My name is Robert Kobe. I do glass work. My work is all blown glass. It's built in layers of colored glass. When it finishes cooling down, I have grinding tools that I use to carve down through that glass. So I start with a blowpipe. I start gathering up glass. I build it up in multiple layers. And some of these pieces you can see in the cross section how the layers are built up. So I build it up one layer on top of the other until I have the amount of glass that I want and the colors are laid out the way that I want. So I blow the piece out to the size and shape it's going to be. It cools down as a whole form. Then I can start the grinding work. So my colors, I use multiple different forms. We buy man colors that are made from different manufacturers. I use bar form, which is solid chunks for the inside colors. All the subsequent layers of colors are fused in with powdered glass. When you learn to blow glass, you start making vessels generally. So I've always enjoyed making pieces in the round. It's kind of, it's, it's nice, kind of like how people like enjoy throwing. So I, always, I wanted to keep making vessels and I was doing a lot of experimentation and surface and decoration. So these pieces also have many layers of colors, but I cut into it and cut into it when it's still hot in the pipe and I move the glass all around so that you can see where the, it's pushed and pulled and folded and whatnot. So the metals that make up the different colors react with one another and you get all this sort of patterning. And that's where these pieces come from. I've always been interested in collecting rocks and geodes. So these works are very much inspired by geology and earth science, natural formation. Some of them feature topographical maps, so all kinds of geological inspiration. I was a drawing major for some time. I've always liked drawing and whatnot, but I was kind of losing the energy from that department, and I had a friend who was interested in glass, and he said, hey, let's go up to the glass shop, and I said, sure, why not? And as soon as I was up there, I saw what they were doing, I wanted to try it, and I switched majors and never looked back, so. What I liked about the glass department was it's more physical, it's, there's, there's, a, there's, you're moving around, you're working with your hands, you're making something in three dimensions, you're working with other people, uh, there's, to me at least, there's a lot more energy involved in the process and I, I enjoy that, the physicality that it takes to make these pieces. This is what I do.